Lisbon Water Department has just lifted its do not drink order after recent state testing shows arsenic levels well within safety standards. Good evening everyone. I'm Amanda Hill and I'm Brian Yacono. That order was put in place around noontime Thursday, a full day after an incident that allowed sludge to enter the town's water supply. News Center means Alex Haskell is in Lisbon tonight with more on this latest development and what had locals wondering where was the communication. Alex? Hi, Amanda and Brian. Well, residents are still picking up bottled water here behind me, despite the town, as you mentioned, just lifting its do not drink order. And this all comes as many started their day here frustrated about how all of this was handled. Well, it worries me. I mean, what's going on? Why is why are we having to deal with this? Dozens of Lisbon residents lining up for bottled water after sludge, possibly containing arsenic, entered the public water supply. This woman says she found out Friday morning after her son told her over the phone, nearly 24 hours after town officials put out the do not drink order online. Oh, well, I got up this morning, took a 20 minute shower and brushed my teeth and drank two pots of coffee. And we're not supposed to be drinking the water. State Senator Jeff Timberlake, who represents Androscoggin County, is criticizing how residents were notified. We needed to get that message out better, clearer. Timberlake says the sludge entered the drinking supply during a routine cleaning of the town's water filters. Somehow in that process, the uh, arsenic that had been trapped in the filters got into the drinking water system. It's still unclear how this all happened, but it's left residents on the hunt for fresh water. Got some water and I'm going to go buy some more. Now, despite the order being lifted, bottled water is still being handed out here until 730 tonight or when supplies runs out. Brian, Amanda, Alex Haskell live for us in Lisbon tonight. Thank you, Alex.